Hi, my name's Patrick, and uh, I am into skiing. I want to start shooting videos um, on a daily aspect. Uh, my editing game is pretty poor, and I really want to get faster at it. So, I'm making these videos to try to help me to get into a groove, I guess, or uh, quick editing, um, because it takes me forever to edit projects, and uh, these things I think will be great for quick edits. Like, I'm not going to color correct or anything like that. A little bit about myself. I live in my car. Um, yes, it's currently a mess. It's always a mess. Uh, I moved in and then I didn't have time to build out a th um, platform for myself, which I really regret at this point because now we're in winter and there's no way I can do it. And uh, I'm sleeping on the cold, hard ground sometimes, or off my car. Um, I need to get my shit on. Um, I have to go to work eventually, but for right now I don't, which is really nice. So, super busy. Um, like I said, super busy. Um, there's snowshoers. It's a fine snowshoe in, but uh, I like seeing it out. So, um, really beautiful today. No, I am missing my sunglasses. I haven't seen them in a couple days. That's bothersome. I didn't bring the drone this time, just because I don't want to bug people. I am so out of shape. I'm maybe like a quarter mile in, half mile in. I'm already really tired. What a nice day. Hopefully, uh, Looks like we have a base, but uh, I'm still a little worried about the sharks out there. And the good now, I'm not breaking trail this time. I did this like three weeks ago. Nobody else was dumb enough to come up here yet, so I had to break trail on a pow day. And then I skied the ground, oddly enough, on this head pow day, so. Where are that guys going? I don't know if you can see him on this camera. Well, uh, I'm stopping quite a bit to film, but um, over there is uh, some mountains I'd really like to try to skin, especially the one on the left. I know that looks so much fun. That entire slope on a safe day. I'm sure it's probably wind loaded, so that's never good. But um, uh, it's because the wind goes from left to right up here. I think. Um, I'm free my path. Look at the clouds. The clouds are cool. I'm about to the ridge. As soon as we get up to the ridge, man, it is so windy. Like, you can see a corner is kind of forming. We'll see. I don't know if it's showing up on the camera. Um, but it can be, uh, it can be intense. Oh, it looks like my battery's getting low, so, um, let's put this away. <sighs> Look how majestic that is. All of that looks so fun to ski. I'll have to go do some of that this year. So because I promised I'd come into work early to help out, um, I'm only doing one lap. I was just, I hurt in the groin. I'm back on the trail, or lower down. Whoop! Bouncer, bouncer, bouncer. Coming down! I think all these dogs. Man, for one away underfoot, these hold that edge really well. Ooh, passing through, thank you, thank you. Man, these are doing a really good job. I had some 102s, and man, they were, uh, I could not hold an edge. This sort of strain would just feel so sketchy. <sighs> I'm back in the car, and I just kind of wanted to talk briefly about, kind of, as I, kind of derobe here kind of want to talk about that on a personal level I, i'm a scaredy cat man conditions were okay 
But I'm I'm scared of something. I don't know what it is. I can straight line like blues no problem. There's even some blacks that I can get some serious speed on on like Keystone and Groom Resorts, Keystone Breck, um, even A Basin. But for some reason, backcountry scares me, and it's more than just like backcountry. It's it's like the conditions. I know I'm leaning back on my skis because I'm nervous. I'd really like to stop, you know. <sighs> It's, it's really preventing me from reaching the next step in my skiing career. And I don't, I don't know what it is. Um, you'll join me again here in a sec. I'm going to drive down a little bit. Um, get, get into a place where there's a little bit more sun and uh, make dinner or lunch.